Hi everyone, this is Yosu Pamani. So today we are going to see about AZ400, which is Microsoft Azure 400 certification, which is primarily uh, used for this Azure DevOps. As I told in my previous DevOps tools video, Azure DevOps is nothing but a value stream management tool, which is an application lifecycle management tool which is most popular in 2019 across all the organization and across all the world. So if you are able to do this AZ400 certification of Azure, then you will be called as an Azure DevOps engineer expert. So you will be getting this logo in your resume and that is a very much value add across all the organizations. And uh, to attain this certification and to attain this logo, I'm going to tell you the procedures what needs to be followed. So first, let's go to Google and find out what is there in the Azure AZ400 exam. So in the Google, when you type this AZ400, okay, the first link that comes is a Microsoft, Microsoft Azure DevOps Solutions link. When you click on this link, you will be able to see this <coughs> details about AZ400. So, which is nothing but Microsoft Azure DevOps Solutions. And when you complete this AZ400 exam, you will be able to get this logo called as Microsoft Certified Azure DevOps Engineer Expert. And now, what are all the things that is available in this exam category? So, if you see, this exam is mainly into seven different skills. So, the first one is designing a DevOps strategy. The next one is implementing DevOps development process. The next was implementing continuous integration. The next is implementing continuous delivery. And the next one is implementing dependency management. And the next is implementing application infrastructure. And the last one is implementing continuous feedbacks. And if you click on each and every one of the link, then it shows you how much percentage of the uh, questions will be covered in this particular skill matrix of that exam. So this day signing a DevOps strategy contains 20 to 25 percent of the questions in the exam and this development process implementing is covering up to 20 to 25 percent of the exam syllabus and this continuous integration has 10 to 15 percentage of weightage of questions and this continuous delivery has 10 to 15 percent and the dependency management is having 5 to 10 percent and the application infrastructure is having 15 to 20 percent and the last continuous feedback is having 10 to 15 percent so depending upon each and every skills you can see what is the syllabus covered inside each and every skills so if you are able to uh, find out like which is your key area you can focus more on that and the rest of the areas you need to put some extra practices to cover everything but on the whole these seven skills will be covered in the AZ400 exam and there is a gentleman called as Gregor Shorty so he has posted an Azure DevOps exam links and everything so i'll be giving this link in my video so it could be more useful for you so he has completed all these certifications and he has given a links to study materials so if you see this AZ 400 none of the study materials will be available in the internet so i have searched in udemy i have searched in linux academy i have searched in some three four websites but there is no proper study material available for this specific AZ 400 so i found out some extra time to look into his videos and if you see this is the list of topics that we covered this seven topics is only given over in the exam skill matrix so this each and every topics if you click on it it takes you to another link and this is a microsoft open adx website which microsoft is giving its own learning so what you need to do you need to sign into this using a microsoft account or an outlook account and you will be logged in and you can enroll this az 400 so this is at eight hours <coughs> video tutorial which you can take and at the end of each and every tutorial there will be a final exam so this course and everything is absolutely free you don't need to pay anything for it and at the end of the each course you will be having some 10 to 15 questions depending upon the topics that is given in the exam so if you are able to cover the final exam you will be getting a certificate from the microsoft stating like you have completed this 
DevOps implementation process. Similarly, for each and every topic, so for this implementing continuous feedbacks, again you can sign into this open edX and you can enroll it. So for 400.1234567, you can get these learnings from these particular links. And if you complete all these seven uh, links, and if you are able to pass all these seven exams, then you are very well free to go ahead and subscribe for this exam, which is an official exam. And for this, you need to pay $165. So depending upon your region, for example, if you are in India, it will be around 4,500 plus VAT. So if you are in any other regions, depending upon that region, you need to pay the fees accordingly. And there is also some options available, such as you can get some so if you are in India, you need to pay 4,800 INR. So there is an option available in Microsoft, which is certify with confidence. So what it does is like it gives you an option of buying extra two free takes. So for example, here, if you see, you can have another two free retakes available if you are failing on the first attempt hope you are not failing on the first attempt but if you do fail so you will get extra two vouchers to take a two free exam so if you click on buy now it will be around 80 dollars so if you pay 80 dollars along with the exam fees you will get microsoft vouchers to take two retakes so if you wanted to have this practice exam and along with that two retakes then you can click on this one so which will be around $90. So if you pay $90 extra, you will get an official practice test for 30 days along with the two MCP vouchers available for retakes. So depending upon whichever you are interested to take, you can buy this along with the exam of $165 or 4800 INR. And uh, if you want to practice this Azure DevOps, you can very well go to this website which is dev.azio.com and it gives you this website so if you have already have an account you can log in and you can practice this